is a crime that shook the borderland two decades ago that is now ending with an execution. Thank you for joining us. I'm Natasha Paloma. I'm Andy Morgan. David Renteria is scheduled to be put to death tomorrow for kidnapping five-year-old Alexandra Flores from a Lower Valley Walmart and killing her. KTSM 9 News reporter Carla Drax the reports on one of the most disturbing crimes to ever come out of El Paso. I just wish you were dead right about now. I can't wait to see the day where I can see you die in front of everybody else. On Thursday, 22 years after this horrific crime, Alexandra Flores' family will see their wish come true. David Renteria sentenced today for a second time to death row. Sentenced in May of 2008, David Renteria will be executed for murdering five-year-old Alexandra after kidnapping her from a Lower Valley Walmart just few days before Thanksgiving of 2001. <laughs> Every single time that I we visit my sister, in her grave every single time, every holiday, every birthday. I wish you were dead. A day that was supposed to be filled with holiday cheer ended up a nightmare. Alexandra's sister telling KTSM last year what happened that day. My parents had agreed that we were all going to go shopping for Christmas gifts. My dad asked for Alexandra and we're like, no, she's not with us. My mom had thought that she was with my dad and vice versa. And then that's when we started looking for her everywhere. The next day, Alexandra was found dead near downtown El Paso with a plastic bag over her head. She was suffocated and her body burnt. Enteria was arrested two weeks later and tried for the first time in 2003. He was sentenced to death but appealed. David Renteria formally sentenced today to death by lethal injection. He was retried again five years later and has been waiting for his execution ever since. Current El Paso District Attorney Bill Hicks says appeals keep coming even the day before the execution. It is possible that uh, the a court could grant to stay all the way right up until uh, until the time tomorrow. Renteria is the fifth El Pasoan to be executed in the past 40 years. Last death row conviction was this year. Facundo Chavez was sentenced for killing El Paso Sheriff's Deputy Peter Herrera. And one more still pending, the state trial of Walmart shooter Patrick Crucius. Justice will be served and and we're going to be there with the victim's family. And now decades have passed, but the hole in the hearts of Alexandra's family is still as big as their love for her, even when the hand of justice rests its case. There is no time that can heal, you know, what she went through, what we as a family went through. And that was Carla Draxer reporting. Renteria is scheduled to be executed tomorrow at 5 p.m. in Hudsville. That's near Houston. The district attorney saying the court can stop the proceeding up until the last moment. Of course, we will make sure to keep you updated.